The increasing economic hardship in Haiti have also impacted one area of concern, education for children. Reports show that more than half of the country lives on less than $2 a day, making it difficult for families to save enough money to send their children to school. But for one school principal, his newfound hope would inspire him to share it with families in his village and his school. Michael Robinson has the story. Mon parent, qu'on y a d'après enquête n'a pas mené, gagné par un tour qui n'a 155 centimes, n'a 155 centimes l'école qu'on y a moins à prendre d'après rapport au bas moi c'est on sent combien qui paye parce que il y a un pile par un tour qui qui dans l'école là tout qui paye moins l'argent. Zem Jean Charles, a lay Protestant preacher at Bethsaida Baptist School, the school he founded for families with children in the remote mountain village area of Decovert. This done to help in providing much needed education for suffering families due to the ongoing economic hardship in Haiti. Because the people have no money for the school, they have to go to the school. They have to go to the school. Continuing to deal with the struggles faced by his school, he would meet another teacher by the name of Janelle Joseph. And in their conversation regarding education, another subject matter came up that would change Exempt's belief about the faith he upheld as a Protestant. That decision led to more people in Decovert learning and accepting the true gospel with the adding of a new local congregation. But even while serving as a head deacon and even changing the name of his school to reflect his newfound faith, the hardship for exempt students still remained until timely assistance arrived through the Care for Humanity project providing a donation that would give schooling for one year to all of his students, tuition free. <laughs> When we help our fellow men, our country people, it helps uh, us to, to spread all the more the good news. And this was just one of many events in addressing the needs of the Church of Christ throughout Haiti. Over a five-day period, ministers of the gospel travel to different places to provide food care packages through Care for Humanity events. This also giving opportunity for the true gospel to be shared through evangelical missions led by the supervising minister, Brother Esteban Innocencio Jr. in the ecclesiastical district of Caribbean. Not only providing material needs, but more importantly, spiritual needs. It is God's will that he wants all people to be saved but they must come to the knowledge of the truth. We continue to unite with our executive minister to teach the words of God in all places all throughout the world, particularly here in the district or in the Caribbean. And with many coming to know and accept the true faith, baptisms were also held in places like Cachon, Decover, and Pediguab. And with that growth, resulted in establishing of more group worship services and less palms and Cachon providing for spiritual needs of the ever-growing family of the Church of Christ in Haiti. The growth of the church is unstoppable. It has been prophesied in the Bible that when God works, no one can stop this work. And, and this is indeed a clear manifestation of God's work. Uh, we're in the very mountains of Haiti. And with the growth of the true faith, more and more people in Haiti get to receive the greatest aid they could have in their lives. It even furthers the, the growth of the church, the people knowing how important the Church of Christ is for the attainment of salvation, because that is the greatest aid to humanity that we can ever offer mankind. This is for the exam, our head deacon in Decovert. Everyone is happy. I'm happy too. 
parce que l'église du Christ a prêché l'évangile avec nous et puis la prière des communautés a grandi. Even with daily struggles in Haiti, the Church of Christ continues to grow, adding more members and local congregations throughout. And this is a proof that God's work continues to spread no matter the circumstances. If you want to watch more current events happening within the Church of Christ, visit incmedia.org slash incnewsworld. Michael Robinson, Iglesia de Cristo News Network. Keep up with the latest news and inspiring stories of INC News World by hitting the subscribe button to the INC Media YouTube channel.